time I want to introduce a man who I'm well pleased, a man who I got to know. And I find this man to be very committed, a philanthropist, a man with a good heart, a man who loves his people and loves his community. Therefore, I have no regret to introduce at this time Mr. John Tarley, Chairman of the Board of Director of the Organization of Liberians in Minnesota and President and CEO of the African Assistance Program on this beautiful day, a day that he decided to share out of his own pocket with his fellow Liberians. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm a talent. Well, I just want to thank God for this time. Um, uh, as I said uh, in the news, uh, this is not about uh, what we're doing today. Is not a, a, a no full share, you know, kind of stuff. Uh, we are not uh, opening the full share. We are uh, doing something that we will be doing uh, every other day. We just decided this time to give back. Uh, uh, when my when my agency, the African Assistance Program, decided what she was going to do at the end of the year, uh, we all agreed. It is important to give back to those who've been coming to us. A uh, lot of the time, people call people clients, but logically, if these clients don't come to us, we, we will not do the job. So we'll give back. You know, we we thought um, though this is not money a founder gave us. This is not money. Uh, uh, somebody in the community say, well, John, you go do this stuff. We sat down and said, well, at the end of the year, what can we do to appreciate the work we've done and to appreciate those who have come to us? So it was at this point that we have decided to give out. Even though um, the 10 out, I would say, is 80% uh, uh, impressive. So many people are calling here, they don't have cars to come, they don't have rides, and so we are here. We brought probably uh, 280 gifts. Uh, 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 we have the cow meat, we have goat meat, we have you know, ch ch chicken. So those are stuff that we are giving out. You know, some people say, I don't want cow, I want goat, and then we give them you know, just anything that they want. And it's our way of giving back. And I still want to use this opportunity to appeal to some of you, uh, you have the opportunity to give out some, to give out to someone in your, in your neighborhood. Maybe there's a little boy, there's a little mom, there's a, you know, someone sitting out, you know, somewhere, and they don't have any food. This season, you know, when you cook, just remember to call somebody to, to just have a bite with you. You know, it's just a matter about sharing, you know. And so that's it. It's not, this is not being mean. It's not about us having money. It's just that we want to share the little that we have. And uh, and because I am a Christian, I try to learn from that that uh, a Bible principle that says you have the little you give, God can trust you with a big content. You know. So I believe when I give the little that I have, then God will see my heart and will give me the big one. And just to make sure, I want to use this opportunity also to announce. Uh, you will not be so surprised. We went to, we have we have applied to a funder for the past six months ago. The funder will not come out who they get. Every period they say we we postpone, we postpone until Monday. We met in our offices on Monday, and we took the decision that the little we have, we will give. And you will be surprised to know Tuesday a decision was made by the founder. And I want to believe, because I am a Christian, I believe it because we decided to give. So God decided to open another door. The founder gave us, we spent roughly $4,000 to give. The founder gave us $180,000. I mean, 
the more you learn to give, the doors are open. So I just believe that's, you know, it, it's just my way of sharing and appreciating the blessings and the gifts and the good things God has shared with me. And I know all that I do. I don't do them in my own strength. I don't do them because I'm educated. You guys, I mean, we've got a lot of smart guys among us. We've got doctors, we've got medical doctors, or people who say the medical doctors, people who say the PhD holders. I mean, we've got great guys. For me, I even go to school. But, you know, I do this thing because, it, you know, to me, it's, it's, it's the blessing of God. So, because God is blessing me, I know it's not a great topic, you know, so that I can share my blessing with somebody. And that's all. So, I just want to, you know, say thank you to those of you who heard and you've come. And we, we, we actually appreciate the fact that you left your home during your cold time and you have come to, you know, to receive gifts from gift from us, you make us to be successful because yeah, had you not come, we would not have given the gifts out. Mm -hmm. So first of all, we want to even say thank you for coming. You know, God bless you. Happy Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. We look forward to a wonderful, a God-given, protected, you know, shield that will cover us in 2000, uh, 2011 and a successful and prosperous 2011. Merry Christmas again. Happy New Year. And thank you.